This is the Sting SD1 4 pack. In this pack come one, two, three, four jewelry skins and eight darts. So this is a stinger. It's technically a jewelry skin and if you remove the cap up here, which I'm not going to, this is technically just the internals of jolt. So how you use it is you grab one dart, put it in the front, push it in, pull the T-style priming handle and fire. And it packs a surprising punch. There must be a really thick plunger tube in there. If you can see it, just in here is the actual spring. So when our prime is down, there's a little white thing on top. And therefore, you load in your dart, and you fire away. And yeah, it packs quite a punch. So these are technically just Alpha Strikes version of a Jolt Reskin. The pack comes with four of them. I bought them for 12 bucks at the Reject Shop. So you can definitely dual wield these. Um, like, they're an emergency pistol. Put this one down. These are the vault. The, the, uh, I nearly called it a Jolt and a Vault. The Stinger is an emergency pocket pistol. And it actually fits quite well into a pocket. So, let's see it fire. By the way, you'll pretty much get a stinger every time you buy an Alpha Strike set. Like the Battalion set, you get a stinger. In the one with the links, and that's the only way you can get links at the moment, you get two of these. In this pack alone, you get four. There's another one that's an eight pack, and you get eight of them, but that's 60 bucks. I don't know why it's 60 for just a bunch of cheap Jolt skins. I mean, it's technically a Jolt with a bit of white and yellow plastic on the top. With the Nerf logo on the Ponzi tube. So let's go fire! Finally! I've actually just got four set up here on the chair. So I'm just gonna grab one, fire, grab another one, fire, grab another one, fire, another one, fire. Some people I've seen in games, they run just jolts, like any jolt reskin. Stingers, double strikes, so they're technically a jolt with another barrel. That you can properly do a wield. Um, triads. <laughs> They're the jolt people. There's a whole society based on these jolts. I swear they're gonna take over one day. Jolt number one. Jolt number two. Jolt number three. Jolt number four. And so, what do I think of the stinger? I think it's pretty fun. But, see this little groove along the top? No joke, my brother came in two minutes ago and tried to fit an attachment on there. His, look, the attachment is bigger than the actual blast itself, so that it just looks stupid. But, nerf. <laughs> Do this as like a joke and sell like billions of them. Make like jolts with a little tack roll on it so you can put it on a scope and go sniper star with your jolts. Cause that'd actually be funny. I really want to see that. By the way, this this attachment is from the Doomlands holdout. If you haven't seen my review from that, um go check it out. I'll leave a I'll leave a link in the description. So back to the stinger, I nearly threw it across the freaking frame. Cause I'm doing portrait. Um, that was a mistake, I think. So yeah, it's pretty comfortable, considering that it's just a regular jolt. I haven't done a review on the jolt yet. That's that's going to be my next... I'm going to do a, like a... This is going to be a series. The jolt reskins. And first up's this. Then we're going to have the jolt, and then we're going to have like... Yeah, this is, this is going to be funny. So, um, please, if you like this video, remember... Oh, crap, dropped it. <laughs> That'll go on the blue for real. So, if you liked this video, please remember to leave a thumbs up. Leave a comment if you did. And please subscribe to Dinosaurs Rule. I need 
let's try and hit 50 subscribers before maybe like mid-November, okay? See you guys, I'm out.